I'm Dr. Erin Brown, professor in Department of Animal Science. This year we've tried an alternative forage. Um, we have planted ryegrass, which is a typical uh, winter crop that producers will plant, but we've also added turnips to our um, planting. And the reason that we planted turnip is because of the cost and the amount of forage that we receive. So turnips are planted at about one pound per acre, whereas ryegrass seed is planted at about 30 to 45 pounds per acre of seed. So when you compare the cost, a bag of turnip seed runs around $90. So you're looking at about a $2 per acre to plant turnips, and you're going to yield anywhere from four to six tons of forage from those turnips. Whereas ryegrass is going to cost you closer to $20 per acre for that seed, and you're going to get anywhere from two to five tons of forage. And so in this pasture, we have planted um, both turnips and ryegrass. Turnips are going to need um, additional nitrogen, a little higher nitrogen than our uh, ryegrass does. This pasture here often receives chicken litter, so we had a higher rate of, or a greater return on our um, seed. We have more forage here from these turnips than we did in some of our other pastures. The cattle will first initially graze the tops of the turnips, then they'll, the turnip top will regrow, and then they'll pull those turnips up and they'll eat the turnip itself. So you can see we planted these turnips back in October. Uh, we had enough rainfall at that time to get some turnip growth, but then we had the fall where we didn't have a lot of growth. Um, so these turnips have um, matured. They've pulled this turnip up. You can see that the, the calves have grazed it as well as we've had some uh, frost on it, but this is a purple top turnip, and so the cattle are starting to pull those up as well. Another benefit to planting turnips besides the cattle grazing them is that the turnip will help in aerating the soil. So as that turnip grows, it expands that soil. There are also some uh, turnip uh, types that are longer that will are intended or used quite often to um, aerate the soil as well. Anything that the cattle don't graze you know, will decompose and provide some nutrients back into that soil. The turnips will lay on the ground. You can find turnips all the way through about June and they'll, um, the cattle will eat them, take a bite, let it fall, and then they'll come and eat them again later on. Uh, turnips are anywhere from 16 to 22 percent protein, so they're a good, um, provide good nutrients for those cattle as well.